I'm Jen from Developmental Science. Um, about four to ten, oh, sorry, about five to ten percent of five to fifteen year olds in the United Kingdom and the United States conduct uh, experience conduct disorder of clinical significance. Such results also contribute to longer term negative outcomes um, in teenage years and adulthood, including uh, depression, substance abuse, and, behavior, and uh, criminal behaviors. The cost of treating a person of con with conduct disorder until 28 years old is up to 10 times higher than that of a typically developing person. Uh, when criminal behavior takes place, um, the cost will rise even further. In the early risers, Conduct Problems Prevention Program, we offered enrichment in social skills and reading to parents of elementary children, meaning each child with adjustment problems uh, was paired with a um, well-adjusted well peer mentor in a... <sighs> in the body system, and uh, sorry, <laughs> um, um, and the program also provided parent training to their parents. We collected information on the behavior of the ch of these children from parents, teachers, peers, and the children themselves. We we checked the children. Uh, for five year, uh, for five time points over two years, we are asking whether the program has a direct effect on the role of parents, which in turn explains the program's continued effects on their children, as in panel B, or whether the program's effects on children's social skills mediates the program's continued effects on their parents as in panel A, results show parents of children in the program um, <laughs> with initial adjustment problems um, declined in their uh, frustration two years later and increased in their parenting confidence and the involvement um, in their... Uh, <laughs> and... Um, <sighs> Um, in the par <sighs> mm. increased in the par parenting confidence and involvement with the children relative to controls. <clears throat> we find that uh, the participation and parent outcome is low and is not related to the outcomes, yet the, the positive parent outcomes were um, were explained by the children's improved social skills. Um, this suggests that the children's social uh, improved behavior elicited better parenting. Often we think that in order to help children to change their behavior, we need to change the parents. But what we found here was that changing children actually change their parents. We can see that intervention have a potential to help both parents and children lead healthy and happier lives. Thank you.